Good day to all. Serbian word lik, L-I-K, referring to the face, is the root of the English words like and likeness. That I will give detailed explanation in this video, but before that I'd like to just an example give a few other words of Serbian origin that are transferred into English directly or as a description. I will do a separate video or a series of videos of English words that are actually originating in Serbian, not in the European, but Serbian. Serbian word jesam, affirmative for person, acknowledging something is yes, is the one in English, yes I am. So if somebody asks me, are you Milan? I would say yes I am, yes sam, ja sam, I am Milan. Exactly the same. Jagode or Jagoda singular is strawberry in English. The way it's written down is in Serbian language s trave beri, meaning pick them from the grass. As we know, strawberries are blooming low on the grass and you pick them from the grass. S is from, trave is grass and beri is pick. Smeten in Serbian is smitten in English absolutely identical meanings, but it can only be explained in Serbian language if you break down the word. Smesti or pomesti something means to mix something up, therefore referring to the person who is of unclear mind. Chastitost in Serbian is chastity in English. The root is the Serbian word chast, which means honor. It generally refers to the all-around honorable person, however, it also includes um, abstinence from sexual intercourse, which is what is the main meaning in English. Uh, being an honorable uh, person, a guy or a girl, meaning not sleeping around. On our heads, we have a face, which is universal for everybody. We all have eyes, nose, mouth, chin, forehead, cheeks, and so on. But leak, L-I-K, is actually the thing that identifies us as individuals. Leak is specific uh, size, ratio, shape, proportion, scale of the eyes, brows, cheeks, mouth, nose for every single person. We all have our own unique leak. Not a single person has the same leak, not identical twins. The same as there is not a single leaf of one tree in the world that is the same. They are all different. In the arts world, what we know from uh, ancient philosophy, the art is referred to as the imitation of uh, reality or imitation of nature. In that regard, when we are doing a portrait from a person, whether uh, from life or from a reference photograph or a painting, we are trying to achieve a likeness. We are trying to make the exact same combination of the elements of the face uh, transferred into the paper, canvas, wood or what have you. That's why in English, if you were successful in achieving a resemblance between the original and the copy, the artwork, you would say you have achieved a likeness. You have achieved a likeness. Yes, it looks like something else. It looks like the original, but like itself again comes from leak. Leak is the root for sličnost and refers to the wider scale of things, as in similarity, resemblance, likeness of all things, as in uh, similar situation, slična situacija. Then English word painting comes from the word paint, which is certain pigment or color, whereas the Serbian word for painting is slika, Again, the word leak in the root and then resemblance s leak a, as in it resembles nature or it resembles the person or whatever we are painting. 
So two meanings for the English word like, uh, I like you, one, and two, I want it like this, right? And again, the explanation is only if we know what leak is, whether you like someone or it is as that original leak. Only when we understand the explanation of the word leak in Serbian language, we can figure it out how it's actually connecting all the dots when we use it in English as like and likeness, especially like and referring to the social networks today uh, when we're collecting lights and hearts and whatever, if you, if you're gonna, are you gonna like something or not? Click the like button. When we think about the people in our lives that made an impact or have an impact, whether they are around or not, uh, yeah, we can remember uh, what they did and what they were wearing and the situations, but it is only when we are remembering their leak is that we are feeling warmth in our hearts because we feel love. When we think of or remember of their leak, we get the emotion of love. Which perhaps explains the situation that we have the past couple of years that we are recommended to cover our faces with something that is hanged around your ears or around your head. For without it, there is no bonding between people. Without a leak, you cannot bond. Which answers the question, is there love at first sight? The answer is yes, because you recognize something which you cannot explain. Science can't explain it. Religion cannot explain it. What is that the inner know within ourselves when we see someone's leak? We know. We know good or we know bad. We like and love somebody or we dislike somebody. No logical explanation, no science, no religion can cover that. Something inside, something within knows. People tend to be in a relationship with others for various reasons, uh, including uh, somebody is well connected in society, personal gain, somebody is good looking. And we even can learn to love somebody's leak for various reasons, to find the goodness in the eyes or the opposite, right? But the thing is, when we are alone with ourselves, we know exactly how we feel about somebody when we remember their leak. Do we feel good or do we feel bad? It is unimaginable to love somebody without knowing their leak. Even if today's we have so many writings between people chatting, we will imagine somebody's leak the way we would like it to look. Something that will make us feel good about thinking about that specific leak. This explanation that I gave perfectly explains what is the real meaning of the words like and likeness in English. Only if we know the true meaning of the word leak in Serbian language, we can understand how and why we are using them. There is no etymology and there is no foundation that can give precise and accurate explanation as this, taking into account that we know that history is being tampered with, including linguistics. All we need to know is another language and we see where the root is and where the true meaning is if we compare the two. If the root of the word and all the other words coming from it are aligning so perfectly and everything can be easily explained in one language, this case Serbian, it is very apparent, self-evident and obvious where the true origin is.